Hey, we are back here on Open. Want to let you know the Bronx Night Market. It's the largest food market in the Bronx and Westchester County. It attracts more than 10,000 people each month with more than 40 hand-put food, beverage, and merchandise vendors representing the city's diverse culinary offerings. Joining us now is Catherine D. How do you pronounce it? D. Desidero. D. Desidero. I want to make sure I got it right. <laughs> Owner of Catatonic and Designer Accessories, and Tarun Anand, who is the CEO of Uncle T's Spices. And we welcome them both now to open. And good to have you. Great. Thanks so much for having Great. us. And so you guys have been participating in the Bronx Night Market, and I'm going to do ladies first. Absolutely. Okay? So <laughs> talk to us a little bit about you got some jewelry and some things that you do. How long how's that been going for you at the market? It's been going great. Um, the Bronx Night Market is this just amazing celebration of everything I love about mm -hmm. the Bronx. So it's nice to be able to display my stuff. Everything is handmade. I right. do everything by hand. Um, and it's a combination of things, beading, metalwork, everything I'm wearing is mine. Right. So And we got some pictures of some stuff that you have as well, some, yes. of, your, some of your jewelry as well. Talk to us about, first of all, how long does it take you to make? It depends on the piece. Okay. So if it's beading, it's usually a little quicker, unless I'm weaving. Or mm -hmm. if it's metalwork, I have to sort of torch it and treat it, so it takes a little bit longer that way. And so what are we seeing right here? Uh, we have some hair accessories, actually, that I've done. Those are pretty quick. Those are easy to do for me. But like, when you say easy to do, how long? <laughs> um, I would say the hair accessories probably take about 20 minutes a piece, okay. so they're not too bad. Um, beading necklaces, it's a little bit longer. There's a pattern, and I have to sort of measure everything out and see how it's going to go. And your so. ears right here, what do, you got? what do we have on the ears? Uh, so this is sterling silver uh -huh. and dragon Buddha beads. So dragon Buddha beads. Buddha beads, okay. <laughs> Learn something new every day. These take a while. It takes a while. Yeah, these take these take a few hours, actually. Looks wonderful, looks wonderful. Thank you so much. Let me go over. Like, we got to talk some food. We, we've got to talk some food. we got to talk some food, food right? I hope everybody's hungry, especially you. I am, I am. <laughs> so what do we have here? All right, so we are Uncle T Spices. We're an all-natural seasonings company, 100% natural, no mm -hmm. artificial colors or preservatives. Mm -hmm. We specialize in no salt and low salt seasonings, but 100% of the flavor. Our goal is to get you to cook healthy, eat healthy, and enjoy your food. Nobody wants to eat something that doesn't taste good. You're absolutely right. Yeah. So what we've got here is we have all of our seasonings laid out on the table, mixed with olive oil. That's all we have. Mm -hmm. You're going to take some bread, you're going to dip it in, and we're gonna, uh, we hope you have your passport because we're going to take you on a flavor journey. Let's take the journey. Let's go. All right. So we'll <laughs> grab a piece of bread. Got it. And we're going to start with this one, and this is our salt-free bad ombre. This is our, me I'll jump over here. This is our Mexican mole seasoning. Mm -hmm. This is great on your tacos, fajitas, that type of stuff. I can dig it, keep going. You can dig it, got yep. it. So we've got this one. This you're gonna take a delicious whiff of. This is for the season. We do a very limited edition batch from the patch. Mm. That's our pumpkin spice. Amazing in your coffee. Amazing in on ice cream. My kids absolutely love pumpkin pancakes okay. and things like that. So, so you, that's you, that you for the season. I'm gonna hook you up with that. All one. right, right. We've got another one. This is our spiciest one called Such a Jerk. We get fresh uh, Caribbean peppers uh -huh. and we dry roast them and we blend it into that. So take a whiff of that one. Oh, dip it in, dip it in. Dip it in, come on. Yeah, dip it in, go for it. No punk Don't here. be shy. I like the spices. There you go. And that one is amazing and it's salt free. Okay. We've got another one here called Puking Good Thai, right? That's our Thai spice. It's mm -hmm. very flavorful. We get fresh lemongrass imported from Thailand. We dry roast it and we blend it in. So make sure to dip, swirl, and scoop. Make sure to get a good chunk of that one. Go ahead, give it a shot. Grab another piece of bread. I'm gonna have to. Don't be shy. Don't okay. be shy. You said dip what now? Dip, swirl, and scoop. We're going to make a scoop, song out of that one. Scoop. It's kind of yeah. like pop, lock, and drop it. Dip, swirl, right. and scoop. Right, there you go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go for it. Let me know what you think. Okay. Yeah, the walk we do is real fast. Yeah. So this is our quintessential pizza topping called Leaning Tower of Pizza. That's our nod to those old school pizzerias that used to be around in New York back mm -hmm. in the 80s. So this is that. My kids absolutely love this one. Come on, as we talk a little bit more. Uh-huh. So this one is, take a different dip, dip of this one. This is Luigi's Revenge. That's our number one seller right now. Luigi. Luigi's Revenge. Mm -hmm. That's amazing on your chicken, amazing on fish, salmon, that type of stuff. Amazing on like roasted potatoes and vegetables and asparagus. So I'm going to tell people where you're going to be, tell them where you're going to be. So we're going to be at the Bronx Night Market, and uh, it's on the 28th. Right. On the 28th, and you can also check us out on www.uncletspices.com. And where can people check you out? The Bronx Night Market as well? Bronx Night Market as well, yes. And also at uh, www.catatonicnyc.com. Got a bunch of stuff. So listen, once you go to the Bronx Night Market, 
Wonderful, wonderful things happening. Uh, that's coming down to the end. But please make sure you come check out the Bronx Night Market. Mm -hmm. Good. Talk to you later. Be right back. Got more open coming up right after this.